How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games and another Daz Watches. Uh, by the match, by the match, by the match, by the match. Today, um, I have been sent a video. It's about nine months old, but I've I've never heard of it, nor did I ever think a video like this would surface. But then I found out that the channel Ladylike, which is the channel the video is on, is owned by BuzzFeed. Kind of made sense then. It all kind of made a little bit more sense. I didn't believe it when I first read the title. Which is, we painted with our period blood, ladylike. Um, there are certain types of behaviour that I would consider ladylike. This is not one of them. <laughs> um, I don't know if this is real. I don't know what we're gonna see. I want to point out that I'm not grossed out by periods or anything like that. I know there's a lot of guys out there that might be. It's a natural part of a woman's life, So, uh, but I'm expecting... A lot of crap in this video about it. Let's watch the video. Oh. <laughs> Getting a period can sometimes be tricky. And often we're taught to hide the fact that we're even on our periods. It never happened. The fuck was that? Did she just put a tampon down the back of her shirt? Someone needs to tell her how to use tampons. <laughs> I don't know if really that's true. I I'm not a girl. Um, I don't think most girls would want to parade around you know, shouting out, I'm on my period, you know? I don't- most girls that I know don't want people to know they are. It's a private matter. You know, you don't walk around with a fucking t-shirt saying that you're on your period. So I don't know if girls are taught to hide it or not. I, what do you feel? If you're a girl, do you feel like you're taught to hide it? Would you like to be more vocal about it? I mean, tell me. Let, let me know. But why? It's the human body, damn it! So with the help of artist Sarah Levy, we're taking period shame and flipping it on its head. It's ladylike, and today we are painting with our menstrual blood. Okay. If I was to... <laughs> Fuck's sake. If I was to paint... A... <laughs> I can't say it. <laughs> if I was to paint a picture with my own sperm... Right, hear, hear me out. <laughs> Would you think, um, wow, G hashtag stop the sperm shame, if there's such a fucking thing. Or would you go, wow, Daz, I'm kind of going to unsubscribe you. You are fucking weird. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Is this, is this doing anything? This is why fucking aliens won't invade. Like, they see this shit and they fuck off back to space. <laughs> We're going to pay for town red. Suck it. Did you like Bleh. My name is Sarah Levy. I gained notoriety for my portrait of Bloody Trump. What in the fuck is that? That, ladies and gentlemen, is what hell looks like. I mean, I've I've seen f some crazy fan fiction. <laughs> I've seen some crazy stories, but some some ludicrous fan art. But that tops it all. Jesus Christ. Sarah, thanks so much for being here and showing us how to paint with our menstrual blood. Thanks so much for having me. First of all, what gave you the inspiration to decide to like? Oh, you know what? I bleed every month, and that's my pain. It was mostly being outraged at his statement about Megyn Kelly, that she was just asking tough questions because she'd been bleeding out of her wherever. It's sort of a stab at all women. It, it, is, it isn't cool, like, not getting political or talking about Trump in general. It isn't cool, like, when guys or gals make fun of, like, someone being on their, their period. Oh, you're just bossy because you're on your period. Like, don't go there. Like, you will get fucking punched in the balls. It's, it is a normal part of life, right? Nothing wrong with it. I think most guys are cool with it. The most guys I know are cool with it. I just don't understand why this is gonna... <laughs> Is this a step forward for women, or is it just making these particular women look fucking insane? <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. If I painted with my own blood, people would say this is a bit odd, Daz. It's a bit odd. You should stop, maybe buy some fucking paint off eBay. <laughs> Trading. I felt like that needed to be called out and stop, and that like humor would be a good way to do it. I came home one day and was on my period. I was like, oh, that's how to do it. In order to paint with our period blood, I have to collect my period blood, which means that I have to use a menstrual cup for the first time. And I have to- You have to collect and store it? Why? <laughs> Why? Why? This is Trump's America too, so I feel like my vagina already clenches a lot right now. <laughs> it's gonna be impossible to get out. What I learned just is that you just have to like do a kegel basically to get it out. And that was that's the key. What I was like, telling that's you. it. You're a strong woman. <laughs> I believe in you and the power of your vagina. All right. What's a menstrual cup? Look, I need to look. I need to look it up. Menstrual cup basis and advantages. It's a flexi cup design 
for use inside the vagina during your period to collect menstrual blood. The cup actually collects the menstrual flow rather than absorbing it like tampons or pads do. Most menstrual cups are made of silicone or rubber. Okay. I actually had no fucking clue they existed. No clue. Uh, we've just learned something today on Daz Games. Floating in the water. There are times where you take the cup out and then you just get those like long membrane strings of blood, kind of like pulling cheese. I would like to like spoon up the clot and like take it in my palm and kind of just see what it's made of. It's Is that normal? Why would you, why would you pick it up and poke it? I have so many questions. <laughs> Are they gonna paint with it or prod it? Uh, what, what, what are they doing? So that your body can make all that stuff. Just embrace that cheese pull. So we have to use a menstrual cup to get our blood and then what do we put it in? I just put it in any sort of glass container. I did the first transferring. We lost some troops, but most of them made it to here. And then I just store it in the- Fuck sake. Please don't put that in the cupboards next to other things because if they get that mixed up, Oh, shit! Uh, fridge until I'm gonna great. use it. In the mm -hmm. fridge. Mm -hmm. I don't have anything animalistic, and now I have my own primal ooze just sitting in my fridge. About to empty my shit. One of these mason jars is wine. One of these mason jars is my period blood. Why are you fucking putting them side by side? I ain't drinking at her house. Shit! Look, there, this is that there may be one or two um, females out there that think that I'm responding to this. Like you typical man. I, I I don't give a shit about periods. I it doesn't gross me out. When you put it in the jar and collect the shit, I start asking questions. Call me insane, but I I do. <laughs> so when painting with blood, is it just kind of like a one shot thing? Because you can't really erase it, right? That's what I thought, and that's how I painted Trump. But since painting it, I've learned that you can actually erase using saliva, <laughs> which is. For fuck's sake. Even she was like, <laughs> So let me get this straight, okay? You collect your vagina blood, all right? And, and store it next to your wine, but not with those saliva. That's, that, that deserves a head turn, <laughs> right? <laughs> oh my word. You're awesome. I can handle any bodily function, but I cannot handle spit. I, I can't even date someone with a juicy mouth. What the fuck is a juicy mouth? What's that? What's a juicy mouth? I can't even think of an impression of what that would be. <laughs> I think I'm gonna paint a glass nice. of red wine and maybe like a moon in the distance. <laughs> Beautiful. Because that's where they need to send you. I, I, um, I don't know. I don't know how to feel. I, I think like there are uh, famous artists that have painted with their own blood. Um, and I, I think that's as equally as fucking fucked up. <laughs> don't paint with your bloods. Ew, why would you want that hanging on your wall? Like someone's bodily fluids all over a canvas. It's not, it's not right. I don't think this is even the right way to get people who are grossed out by periods, non grossed out by them. I don't know why they are grossed out by them, but this isn't fucking helping. <laughs> like she has a fear of spit, for instance, right? This woman here doesn't like spit. It's not gonna help, okay, if I, collect all my saliva in a jar, and then fucking throw it over a wall. <laughs> it's, not, it's not gonna help her, is it? <laughs> I think that all women are witches, and the period is a reflection of that. I hope my period picture doesn't smell, though, because I've been collecting my blood, and it smells. Well, that's what fucking happens! Jesus Christ, will someone help these people? Crew is just sitting over there watching us, covering <laughs> their noses, might I add? <laughs> so do you have any, like, tips or pointers for us as we're like going into this. Don't do it. <laughs> Don't do it. Even the, the crew and team are over there like grossed out by it and they're all they're all women. Like, um, I imagine it, it might smell and stuff. It's just unhygienic, right? You don't do that. You didn't do that. You're not supposed to do that. It's not art. The main thing is just to have fun with it. Explore the blood as blood. And not no! Don't explore it! Stop! Just any other red thing. Figure out how can you use the clots or the, the yeah, mucus. Use, ooh, I yeah. can use my clots Just have fun the, with it. as the chocolate chips. <laughs> ooh! Yeah. I was gonna cook lamb tonight. I was looking forward to it as well, you know? I may, I may have had a glass of red wine with it, but... I don't think I can now. It's just not normal behavior, is it? It's not. <laughs> 
How's it going, Tasslers? Welcome back to Dad's Game. Today, I'm going to paint with my own shit. <laughs> we all have blood to paint with. We have our still life portraits all set up. Oh yeah, is it a date? Or is it a portrait with period blood? Not a fucking date, that's for sure. <laughs> Come in, welcome to my home. Make yourself at home. Oh, this painting? Yeah, I painted it with my period blood. Where are you going? Come back. <laughs> I have goosebumps because I'm so nervous about opening my jar. Open the blood. I actually loved the moment where we all opened our jars. All right, well, that wasn't so bad. Hello, blood. Can I have a... <coughs> we all leaned into the fact that it smelled awful. It's because it came out of your vagina. You know, that's why it, that's why it goes in a tampon and you throw it away. You don't keep it and create art with it, do you? Oh, it smells. You smell it. It hit over here, yeah, it did. It smells like eggies. Got a pussy up, let's do this, sisters. <laughs> I might chew on some gum while we do this, just to kind of like have a different, it, oh wow, it's not letting up. I'm gonna get some gum. I have to remind myself that watching these types of videos pays my rent. <laughs> Today, painting with a tampon. She's using the tampon like a Crayola marker. Oh my I've God. I've never seen that before. It's dribbling, it looks so fresh. Ooh. It's kind of funny how I feel more comfortable painting with this tampon than I do painting with a paintbrush. Why? Why? That's so stupid. Like, why? Why would? Why do you feel more comfortable with a tampon rather than a paintbrush? My whole life, I've um, wanted to paint with tampons, but now I have that chance, and I feel more comfortable. Like it's a paintbrush. What's uncomfortable about using a paintbrush? No. I have no experience with painting. I have very little artistic talent at all. There have been times that I've drawn something and shown people and they laugh because they genuinely think it's a joke. Well, now now they're not gonna laugh. They're gonna fucking unfriend you on Facebook. But it's not. I'm making the first stroke. Ah! Taking that first tampon stroke completely changed the game for me. And I was just immediately empowered. Ooh, clut. This is proof that tampons don't absorb shit. This is my blood, it is my life. This feels weirdly normal. Oh, oh gotta get a little chunker. I don't, I don't know how much more I can do. I physically don't know how much more I can take of this stupidity. <laughs> like that silence of concentration. A favorite moment while I was painting is when I was working with my little chunks and I would be like, Sarah, come look at my chunks. And she would run over and be like, oh yeah, nice, that's cool. <sighs> I'm speechless. I'm actually fucking speechless. I don't have anything to, I, 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 I can't think. <laughs> I, for the first time ever, I'm speechless. Funky chocolate chip. Yes. Wow, we really just collected our blood and did this. I never thought I'd say this while painting with period blood, but I'm getting kind of- I never thought I'd say this whilst painting with my own blood. <laughs> it's like so casual. <laughs> it's, I mean, what, what, what do like normal girls think, think, think of this? What, what, what do you, what do you think of this? I, am I wrong to think this is fucking like, no, I, I think it's, I don't think this is normal. <laughs> they call, call me insane. This is not normal. Uh, it don't matter where the blood comes from. Don't matter if it comes from your vagina, your arm. Fucking blood bank, murder victim. If you're gonna paint with blood of any type, I automatically think you're insane. Um, but this is this. I, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I'm hungry. <laughs> Morgan up an appetite. I was more nervous about doing it in general. Once it was done, I was like, I don't care what people think. People are lining up. I didn't think I was gonna get nervous, but now that I just hear voices outside the door, I think I'm a little nervous. I'm fine. I'm gonna tell people I didn't paint on it. I just like squatted over <laughs> it. Yeah, that'll help. That, that'll help. That'll, that'll, you know, get them clapping. Yep. I don't understand like why periods are viewed as negatively, you know? Um. It is a perfectly normal thing that every woman goes through, and that's fine. But at the same time, when you take anything like that, whether it be period blood, or sperm, or spit, or shit, or vomit, that, when you put it on a canvas, okay, <laughs> it's, it's not normal. It's not normal. There are people inside of insane asylums with uh, very serious issues because they can't stop writing 
their Twitter handle using their own shit. Should they be released and considered an artiste? No! 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 I I don't know what the point of this was. I It's fucking stupid. It's one of these extreme feminism things. Um, again, I'll say it again. I've been here before. A lot of people uh, seem to make the mistake when I react to feminist type topics that I choose them because I want to hate on them. And it's not that it's not the case. I, I just believe in equality for all. You know, male, female, big, tall, short, skinny, race, colour, gender, whatever. People just deserve to be happy. You don't have to paint with your own blood to stand out. Or it's not going to do anything for women's rights. It's not going to do anything for the women's movement. It's not going to do anything at all other than make you look like a fucking psychopath. I I'm going to leave the video there. I think there's a little bit more to watch. But um, I'm good. I'm good on that one. <laughs> Guys, thank you very much for suggesting this video to me. It's always interesting to find topics like this that actually, they actually exist. Uh, get your merch. Link in the description below. It is selling like a Daz church. And I will see you in the next video. Stay dazzling. <laughs> oh shit, I wasted an hour. Jacking off to Zoella, not trying to be thick or I swear the thumbnail showed a nipple But she's fully dressed in a top shop dress she was paid to wear It's my cross to bear, if I see a sick pic I'ma click on there, there.